You will need to know these for your exam, without a doubt, um, and they like to pull up on these. So first of all, there's specificity, progressive overload, adaptability, reversibility, individuality, recovery time, and plateau. Now, with each of these, as we go through, you'll going, oh God, they're quite similar words, they're quite big words, but there are distinct differences in the words and what they mean. So we need to be aware of what they are. Um, so let's go through each of them in good detail. First one is specificity. And this, although sounds like an absolute mouthful, doesn't it, specificity, it's basically saying that the activity that your client needs to be doing, the training activity that they're doing, needs to be specific to the goal. So if Mary's goal is to complete a swimming race, then specificity principle states that her training should include swimming. It's as simple as that. If she's doing cycling, it should include cycling. Um, and it's about making it specific to the goal for specificity.